Hello again, and welcome back to Grape School. Today, we're going to be talking about a grape called Aioritico. Now, it's Greek. The beauty, the coolest thing about Greek grapes is that they have a tremendously long history. Uh, their indigenous varietals have been there for sometimes thousands of years. Take, for instance, Aioritico. Um, it's you know, one of, its, one of its nicknames in Greece is the Blood of Hercules, because apparently uh, when Hercules slayed the Nemea lion, which is the region in the southern Peloponnese where it grows best, he drank this either after or before to gain some courage. Now, the beauty about this grape is that you don't need to be courageous to try it. It's extremely accessible. What does the Aoritico taste like? For me, it's, it's got a fruit quality, which is like Barbera, though a little bit less acidity. So for those of you who like more New World style wines, which are less acid, it's absolutely perfect. Um, plums, spice, very easy to understand great. Now, I got a really, really good one this week to recommend for you from Gaia. Um, it's the Aoritico 2012. Now, ooh. It's just got such a rich and deep nose. It's just so rich and red. And when you taste it, it does have actually pretty good acidity for the grape. But you'll see on the finish, it's just so nice and mouth filling. Like this is a perfect wine for braised meats, um, for anything which is richly textured or maybe something like a pork roast or you have mushrooms because the bright red fruit in this, it would be perfect with mushrooms. So, be courageous. Well, you don't even have to be. Try Aoritico, the blood of Hercules. Talk to you next week.